welcome to pct stro in this video today we are going to see how you can install and you can configure grammarly extension which is grammarly app in your safari browser in the mac operating system so what grammarly is actually grammarly is a you can say like it's an app which help you to correct your grammar mistakes if you love writing on the system like if you're a blog writer or if you're a if you write books or ebooks then i think this grammarly app is one of the best app for you which help you to write uh, grammatically correct and it also help you if you do any spelling mistake while writing on the system so guys let's proceed further here and guys if you have not subscribed my channel yet please go ahead and do subscribe the channel so in order to install the uh, grammarly app or the extension to your safari browser first you need to open safari and in safari search for grammarly and go to the grammarly.com now you can see it's coming up great writing simplified compose bold clear mistake free writing with grammarly all power writing assistance right it's giving an ex example also how you can correct as you can see at the right side now here you can see there is a green box coming up with add safari add to safari it's free so you can i will just go ahead and click on the, that option and here now it has open a new window and you can see it has just opened the app store of my mac operating system and here you can see there is a cloud option coming up with down arrow that means i can click on this cloud arrow with down arrow and it will start downloading as you can see now and if you are downloading the grammarly for the first time you will get an option uh, which will say like get so you will have to click on that get option but i already had grammarly in my safari and i removed to just show you an example this is the reason it was coming up with the cloud and down arrow so as you can see it's downloading now here and after downloading i will show you how you can configure it so you can see the download is complete so i will click on this open option and now here you can see it's clearly saying here that open setting click the check box to grant permission that means the grammarly is already added we will have to only grant the permission to grammarly in the uh, settings and it's also show an example how we can do that so i will click on this open settings option and now here you can see the grammarly app is coming up grammarly for safari so just beside that there is a small square icon coming up so i will click on this square icon and then it's asking for the permission here as you can see are you sure you want to turn on the extension grammarly for safari so yes i want to turn it on so i will click on this turn on option and uh, i think we are done here now so you can see the grammarly is already installed in the safari as an extension and that is coming up on the top here as you can see here now right it's coming up and if you want to if you have account with grammarly already already you can sign in by clicking on sign in button or if you don't have you can sign up with the account here you can see by clicking on this option so that's all guys uh, i i believe i have cleared everything and uh, if you have still have any query you can write in the comment section i will be there to answer and uh, guys if you want to go for the premium version of this grammarly uh, i'm living in uh you can see like a coupon code or you can uh click on the link in the description so that the grammarly team can uh come to know that you are coming you are going to buy them through my link so you can click on the link and you can go and uh, sign up for the grammarly premium app if you want so thank you so much guys for watching this, uh, this video and as i said if you have any query you can write in the comment section i will be there to answer your query thank you